In this video, I am going to show you how to download and install BSL shaders for Minecraft Java version 1.21.10. So, let's get started. To begin, simply go to your web browser, and I will have links in the description if you need them. But here, just go to your search bar and search up mod Rinf, like so. Now enter, and here you'll find mod.com, click on mod Rinf, and this will bring you to the mod Rinf homepage. From there, just go to the top of the website to discover content, then go down to shaders. Now, what you want to do is either scroll down, and you'll find BSL shaders here, or you can always search up BSL here, and it will show up here. So there's two ways to do this. Anyways, once you've found it, click the name, and this will bring you to this page here. Now what you want to do is simply go to the versions tab, and it'll bring you here, and for shaders, it's this like nice and easy, you simply want to go ahead and find the latest release of a shader, and just click the green download button. And there you go, you now have your shader for Minecraft. Although, you need to get yourself iris to use shaders for Minecraft, so the way you do this, you simply want to go to a new tab, you want to go to your search bar, and search up iris shaders, like so. So iris shaders, enter that in, here you'll find irisshaders.dev, click on iris shaders here, and this will bring you to this page. From there, just go to the blue download now button here, and then go to the blue download universal jar button. And there you go, you now have iris shaders. One more thing is, if you can't run the jar files, that's because you don't have Java for Windows. So, if you want to get yourself Java for Windows real quick to actually use the iOS installer, simply go to a new tab, and I will have the website in the description as well. But just search up JDK25 or Java25, enter that in, and if you scroll down, you'll find that we have Oracle here with oracle.com. Click on Java Downloads, and then you'll be sent to this page here. From there, just click Accept All, and then scroll down, and you'll find JDK25, click on Windows here, and then click on the x64 installer link, which is right here. So click this link to download and install Java, and then you'll be able to go ahead and actually use the iOS installer. So, once you did this, you can go ahead and close or minimize your web browser. I'll close mine, and from there you can go to your file explorer to access your downloads folder. Okay. Once you're here, just go ahead and double click the iOS installer. And this just opens up the iOS installer here. Make sure the game version is correct. If it is, you can do iOS only or iOS with Fabric if you want to add some mods later. And click install. And there you go. So once you're done here, you can close the iOS installer and open up the Minecraft launcher. Now we're basically almost done. You will have to simply go ahead and actually open up the Minecraft instance with iOS. So here it is, just go ahead and find it, and once you did, you can just click play. And you might want to do I understand the risks, and click play again, and now you won't have the pop-up every time you want to play the game. And then you'll be able to go ahead and actually be able to add BSL to the shader packs folder. So here we're just downloading the game again, and what you have to do is just wait a bit and then you'll be able to actually go ahead and actually add the shader to the game. So it kind of works like resource packs. So yeah, let me show you how to add BSL to Minecraft. Okay. So yeah, let's just wait for the game to actually load up like so. And then we'll be able to actually go ahead and continue. So once you have Minecraft here, you will want to go to options here. That's the bottom button here. And then you will want to go to the video settings tab. And here you might have like a little hello thing, just do close. And from there you will want to access shader packs. Then you want to go to open shader pack folder here. From there you want to go to your downloads. You want to select and copy BSL. And then go to the top left arrow to go back to the previous tab here which is shader packs. And click paste. So there you go. It is very easy. You just simply copy paste BSL in DOM of shader packs. It's gonna be easy. So what you want to do now is simply go back to the Minecraft instance here. You will notice that we have BSL and if you want to turn it on, you just click on it and click apply. As we're not in the game, it does go quite quickly. 
So if you want to disable it, you do the same thing and it's pretty much instant. So here, if we go back to the Minecraft home screen here, if I go to a single player world, now you can use a server or a realm, but I'll just go to a single player world just to show you this nice and quick. And once we're in a world here, what you can do is go ahead and activate the shader. As you can see, it's off because I turned it off. But what you can do is go to escape, options, video settings, shader packs, and here select BSL and apply it. And there you go. If I close this here, you will see that we have BSL. And you can of course go to shader pack settings here to access different settings of BSL. So you can change your quality. You can change like the uh, sun. It can be round, for example. If I do apply on all this and we leave everything, we have round sun and we have higher quality shadows. So yeah, it is very simple to do and it works great as you can see. It works for Minecraft Java 1.10. And if you go ahead and click R, of course, it just, just reloads the shader. So if you ever have a use for that, you can do that if you want. But yeah, that is the idea here. That is how we download and install BSL shaders for Minecraft Java version 1.21.10. So yeah, if you liked this video, make sure to like and subscribe and see you for the next one. Bye.